The question is, can we develop machines that can be recursively self-improving, but which maintain themselves reliably within a sort of a space, a subset of potential machines of this sort that carry on thinking of human beings as important, and indeed as very important as their main raison d'etre. Um, in order to make sure that this happens, one has to do some very careful mathematics and some very careful um, planning to make these machines in a way that retains that property. It's worse than that. The Singularity Institute takes the view that we've got to get there first. If someone comes along and invents recursively self-improving systems that do not have this, what, what we like to call friendliness property, and that happens first, they will, they will you know, get rid of humanity rather quickly if we're unlucky. So we'd better, we'd better develop friendly AI before anyone else accidentally develops unfriendly AI. Now, whether friendly AI is even possible is unknown at this point. Whether it's possible to invent machines which you can give the freedom to improve themselves without giving them the freedom to become unfriendly. We just don't know whether that's possible. But it's worth trying.